So over here you can see that I have a bunch of files and over time you may have a lot of files and you may not know where those files are. So in that case, what you can actually do is you can use the uh, set everything area right here to set out for your files. If I were to go around and click right here, let me just go around and type in tututube over here. Then uh, uh, the files related with tututube, that is the file containing the word tututube actually pops up right here. You can go around over here and click on any one of them to access them as well. So if I were to go around and click it, you can see that this is a PDF file right here and it accesses that out right here. Let me just close it over here and click on show more results. So once you do that, um, actually uh, the, uh, the results uh, show up and if there are more files uh, uh, to display, it'll display that out as well. You can also go around over here on the top and then filter it out according to, let's say, for example, just by photos. And you can also go around and say just the files that I modified last week, I want to display that or maybe last uh, month right here or last year. So once I do that, you can see it further filters out my sets over here as well. So I can go around over here and let's say, for example, I'm going to search for logo now right here. Then I'm going to go around and search for uh, another thing like, let's say, for example, image right here. So I can go around and keep on searching for these images over here, as you can see, just like this. And that is how I can set out for different files and folders, as you can see right here, in case I don't know where they are. So I can just use this feature over here. Uh, which is a little set in then for your particular files inside of OneDrive. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.